I mean, just to be in this moment, I mean, unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, that was something we've been working on, and Doug and I were talking. I was like, let's just run it. Uh, it was a good time, and uh, the end was a little wider than I thought, so I was like, I really need to sell like I'm not doing anything. And uh, it worked. Trey made an amazing throw right on the money. I just looked it in. And uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, we've, worked, we've repped it for a while, so I was excited to get it uh, run and in the Super Bowl. Good, how are you? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I mean, we talked a lot this last, you know, this last week about, you know, a couple of years ago, there's a time where I was thinking about hanging up the cleats. And, you know, I think as people, you know, we deal with struggles. And that was, you know, a moment in my life where, you know, I thought about it and, you know, I prayed about it. And, you know, I'm grateful that I made the decision to come back here and play. Um, you know, I wouldn't be out here. Um, without God, um, without Jesus in my life. I can tell you that first and foremost, I don't have the strength to come out here and play this game like that. Um, and that's a everyday walk. I mean, we have struggles as people and uh, you know, that's just been my rock and my family. I didn't get to see Tom. Um, I was looking for Tom. It got pretty crazy really fast. Uh, I mean, he's one of the greatest of all time, you know, guy does it right he's been unbelievable he was unbelievable tonight um you know can't say enough about him yeah i mean i felt good i mean i you never really know what it's going to be like when you're going to a super bowl i've never been here before so there, there there are normal nerves you got butterflies i mean it's a big game i mean it doesn't get any bigger than this so but i felt good i felt calm i think the big thing that helped me was knowing that I didn't have to be Superman. I have an amazing teammates, amazing coaches around me, and all I had to do was just go play as hard as I could and play for one another, play for those guys, and uh, you know, not look at the scoreboard, not look at the time, just go out there and play. Don't worry about it. And uh, you know, came away with a victory. I didn't switch my mindset. I wasn't worrying about the scoreboard. I wasn't worrying about the time. I was just playing ball. Um, I think sometimes you start worrying about that so much and it starts creeping in your brain. I was just playing. I, whatever play Doug called, I was just going to go out there and rip it. And, uh, you know, that was sort of our mindset going into this. We, got, we had to play a strong 60 minutes, and it took 60 minutes to win this game. No, I'm excited. I mean, quarterback going out on a route. I was pumped to go over there and talk to Doug, and, you know, we agreed on it. And... Uh, you know, like I said, we worked on it for a long time and we executed it perfectly. That's probably the best it's looked, so we hit it at the right time. I mean, we've probably been working on it for a month, so. Yeah, I mean, being on the podium with my wife, Tori, and my daughter, Lily, I mean, that's what life's about right there. I mean, we're Super Bowl champs, but time does stop when you look in your daughter's eyes and you get to celebrate this moment. I got to look in my wife's eyes. I get to celebrate this with her. I mean, they've been there, you know, my wife's been there through everything. My family's been there through everything. And to be in this moment, to celebrate this moment, that's what it's about. And, you know, I'm just grateful. To be a part of the Philadelphia Eagles' first championship, I mean, we've, we've all waited a long time to be in this position to be world champions. The people who bleed green, the people of Philadelphia, the people all across the nation that support the Eagles, they've waited a long time. Mr. Lurie's waited a long time. You know, being a part of this, being drafted to Philadelphia, and being fortunate enough to come back and be a part of this team, to be a piece of this puzzle, I mean, it's been a long time coming and 
You know, I know there's going to be a lot of celebrating tonight. Bruce. You know, I, I was really staying in the moment. This is always the outcome, the goal. But I feel like if you put it on a pedestal, you start forgetting to do the little things, the preparation, the practice. You start forcing balls because you're trying to play at a level that, you know. So when this became reality was when we won the NFC Championship game because that was what was staying in the moment. And I wasn't worrying about the next day. I was worrying about that moment. And that's what, you know, I did today, we did today. Just staying in this moment, doing everything you can in the moment to be successful. And the outcome was we were world champs. Thank you. Thank you all.